uh, good day class today's topic is weather climate and vegetation in south africa today we'll be focusing on weather which is our subtopic to the introduction what is weather weather is an atmospheric condition at a given time in a particular place if you are feeling hot or cold or feeling the rainfall on you then you are experiencing the effects of weather weather is about what's going on in the sky and clouds right now in other words is the daily state of the atmosphere when it's raining when it's cold when it's hot snowing that's weather so there are four elements of weather which is the temperature cloudiness precipitation and wind moving on to temperature what is temperature temperature is the degree of hotness or coldness of an object it is how hot or cold the place or an area is it is measured in degrees celsius the temperature variates with season to season where some seasons are very hot and some are very cold as we know we have uh, different seasons we have winter we have summer we have autumn and we have spring and as you can see the trees we can see changes with these uh, seasons where in winter we see the trees weeding, their leaves falling so forth and so forth so december to january are known to be very hot months where june and july are known to be very cold months even we know we, we catch colds or flus during this winter seasons may june july yeah now uh the temperature uh temperatures as we said on the last slide they are represented in degrees celsius here we have uh, a picture showing degrees celsius on uh friday have days of the week on friday the temperature was 20.6 degrees celsius so thought and so thought so as we know weather is not stagnant it's changing day by day moving on to cloudiness one will ask what is cloudiness cloudiness or cloud cover refers to the extent in which the atmosphere is covered by clouds and is estimated in fractions or percent okay overcast refers to near 100 percent cloudiness while clear refers to zero near zero percent cloudiness overcast some days uh the sky will just be cloudy and some days we'll just see a clear sky okay picture showing cloudiness sunday this is a clear sky day then you have a cloudy day where a stormy day will be there will be thunders and all that have rainy days rainfall and we have snowy it can be snowy it can be windy precipitation what is precipitation precipitation refers to the water falling from the sky it can be in the form of rain snow hail etc rain is water in the form of liquid falling from the sky so you know rainfall can be heavy can be light rain drizzle yeah so if hail is water in the form of solid ice falling from the sky snow is water in the form of thin ice flakes falling from the sky with hail hail can hit you on the on the head and it will hit you but then with snow it's so thin it's so light 
and then it can uh, hide you from falling when falling on the sky. Precipitation continued. Uh, rain, snow, sleet, hail. Yeah. Wind. Okay, with wind, wind is the movement of air caused by the uneven heating of the earth. Uh, by the sun and the earth's own rotation. That's what causes wind. Winds range from light breezes to natural hazards such as hurricanes and tornadoes. Okay, this picture shows uh, the movement of, of, of wind. It's represented in these arrows here. And on the right, here we see the arrows here and the direction. There's also the speed up there. So yeah. Moving on, okay. That's where our our lecture for the day will end. And then we go to summary. Summary with let's see what we've 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 learned about from the above. Weather. What is weather? What is an atmospheric condition at a given time in a particular place? Four elements of weather, temperature, darkness, precipitation, and wind. Rainfall is a type of precipitation. It is measured with rain gauge. The measuring units of rainfall are centimeters. Now the temperature, hot or cold, the place or an area is, and it is measured in degrees Celsius. That was the lecture for today. We've learned about the weather. So, uh, if there are any questions, uh, I'd like to, to take any questions. Any clarifications? Uh, thank you.